I'm coming up to Canada, eh? I'm gonna go up to Canada, see what life's like up there, eh? Uh, I want you guys to talk. We're gonna talk about poutine, eh? And rolling maple syrup in the snow, eh? And I'm going to practice my Canadian accent. And I'm gonna learn some Canadian lingo. Like... Timbits? Canadian lingo... Eh? Canadian lingo... Quiz? How much Canadian slang do you know? Alright. Uh... Okay, Canada's... Bear. Synonym for lots of, synonym for a little bit, synonym for sick, or synonym for upset or sad. If so... Bear? I'm gonna say that's... Bear is a little bit. Okay, bear is wrong. I've got bear food at my place. What does that mean? Bear? B-A-R-E. I've got lots of... I've got bear food at my place. I have lots of food in my place. Okay. Beauty describes an exceptionally beautiful person. It's a beauty. What? He's bringing Timbits to the party. What a beauty. Okay. TTC. Oh god. You guys have acronyms? TTC. That Tim's coffee. Toronto's terribly cold. Toronto's public transit system or Toronto's taxi service? I'm gonna say that's the public transit. Okay. So the TTC is the Toronto Transit Commission. That's the Toronto train. That's a beauty, eh? Eh? Uh-uh. W-Y-S, whatever you say, what you say in, what's your status? Uh... What? Whatever you say. Wait, what? It's used to ask how someone's feeling. I want to get food. What you saying? What you s what? What you saying? W Y S. Who wrote this? Do you guys actually talk like this? I want to get food. What you saying? What? Okay, dart. A dart is a synonym for a restaurant, for a cigarette, for eat, or for pee. I got a dart. Eat. Cigarette. I'm gonna have a dart outside. What? Darts? It's a cigarette. A dart. Canadians, some Canadians called cigarettes darts. W-Y-S, won't you simp? <laughs> what? You swim? You si swimpin? Simpin? Shrimpin? Nobody talks like this. No, we're not gonna stop. Mad. Synonym for few, for cold, for not, or for very. That's very. Yeah, because we use that here, too. In America. It's mad cold out, eh? No one talks like this. I'll type these out here so you guys can see. Waste ute. Uh, someone who's lazy. Someone who litters. Someone who is a waste of space. Someone who seems much younger than their age. What's a ute? So that's just someone who's lazy. Oh, it's... It's a waste of space. So, like, Nero is a waste ute. What does that even mean? Reach. Like, when you're reaching, when somebody says something that's, like, really... If someone tries to say you're doing something, or they're accusing you of something, and they're like, Well, you... You... And you say, that's reaching. Someone that's annoying. No. What? You'd use it to tell somebody to come over. Reach my house, I'm having a party. Re... Reach? Hey guys, reach my stream. I'm having a party. Reach... Reach, um, Fan Expo... Canada. I'm having a panel. This one's real? Oh... Do they not know what words mean? <laughs> I'm cheesed. Wait, I think we know what cheesed is. Oh, hey, I'm absolutely cheesed, eh? I'm... I'm hungry, I'm lonely, I'm excited. It's either excited or annoyed. I'm cheesed to meet you. I think it's gonna be... Annoyed. 
No, excited. It means to be annoyed. The example given is... The TTT was late, eh? Oh, I'm so cheesed. Oh, I'm so... <laughs> the TTC was late. I'm so... Poutine. What does this one mean? I'm just kidding. This isn't one of them. Wheeling. When you're driving, when you're excited, when you're ready to leave, or when you're flirting. I'm wheeling with excitement. It means flirting. Poutine this. <laughs> Okay, wheeling! Interesting. And finally, Mickey. Well, in the Annie Broadway, Mickey is... A Mickey is a drink, isn't it? It's a small bottle of liquor. <gasps> I got it right. I got 4 out of 11 correct. I got a 28% on my Canada... On my Canada quiz. Ute is Toronto slang. The rest of civilized Canada do not claim them. <laughs> no Canadian says these, making me cheesed. <laughs> uh, thank you for your super chat, sorry, tea, and Sally Kid, thank you, girl. None of us talk like that. All right. Okay, real Canadian slang. I'm not done with this. Sorry, I enjoy this, so. Common Canadian slang. A double double? Loonies and toonies, a toque, poutine, wash milk. Hey, do you guys have a funny word for milk that I maybe shouldn't say? This is this says it's real Canadian slang. All right, in Canada, it's a word that is plastered on milk to oh probably ho hom hormone, homogenized. Yeah, homo milk, homogenized. Ah ha ha ha. So <laughs> Okay, so homogenized milk is shortened to homo milk in Canada. <laughs> I'm 12 years old. Uh Anyway, we're moving on. A pencil crayon. What? So, pencil crayon is a colored pencil, interesting. Icing sugar? That's the same. Scoop, skookum? Did you guys say skookum? Chat, you guys are looking absolutely skookum today. I'm gonna use that at the panel. Apparently, it's from British Columbia. Is anybody here from BC? It means exceptional or impressive. Skookum. Shrimps, you look so skook, skookum. Timmy's, I know what Timmy's is. Hang a Larry. Hang a Roger. Oh, hang a Larry is take a left, and hang a Roger is take a right. Oh, okay. There's other... There's words there's like... Bang a left, bang a right. I think. Is what... I guess what I hear. Or bang a Yui. You can bang a Yui as well. Hang a Larry! To the left! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Runners are sports shoes. Pop is a common name for soda. Uh, parkade. A parkade is a Canadian word for a multi-level parking structure. Americans call it... Yeah, the parking garage. You guys call it a parkade? Why do you make it sound so fancy? It's a big thing of cement. Oh uh, yes, let me pull my Prius into the parkade. A kerfuffle! I know, kerfuffle. Uh, clicks! An alternative for this is kilometer. Some spell it with a K as well. The house is about five clicks away. Clicks? Guri, you... You're cheesing me up, you tabernack. I'm annoying you. <laughs> What's a tabernack? Alright, I'll stop. Sorry, Canada. Uh, waste ute and cheesed is the Toronto equivalent of valley girl. So it's a worthwhile addition to your valley vocab. Oh my god. Oh my god, eh? I'm so cheesed. <laughs> okay, it's time to end the stream. You're weird, eh? Roaming data. Oh no, you guys probably say data. I know Canadians, you guys say pasta. Instead of pasta. You say pasta. And do you guys say Mario too? A caribou wouldn't get out of the road on my way to Tim's. Couldn't get my morning Timmy's day, so uh, he really... Oh, he had me cheesed. Oh, yeah. 
That caribou really had me cheesed, you know. And my my toke real tight. <laughs> okay, bye! <laughs> Thanks for coming to the stream, you guys. Uh, I had a very nice time. Thank you. Anyway. A! A, A, A! Pretty painful way to end the stream. Good night, Phil. <laughs> oh, yeah, Same! Don't be a hoser. Gotta watch out for the dirty dangles. You hoser! Alright, hosers. I'll see you this weekend. Bye! Bye-bye! <laughs>